Good morning. I feel like eight camel toes. And then I say, you know, I got a contest right now. I'm going with uh, Pete Carroll's gum. It's a contest of how many bananas, bananas I can swallow or deep throat. I, I, I bet her that I could deep throat more bananas in one day than more cocks she sucks in the TTC in one day. It's a little contest going. Anyway, let's get off to the video. Breaking news out of New Jersey. Four losers are meeting up at a bar. Three of them are Eagles fans, and one's Falcons fan. Well, I'm not going to say the losers. Sports Live ATL, Desert Eagle, Nitro Freak, and who's the other guy? The guy that doesn't do YouTube videos anymore. Eagles fan for life. A banana a day keeps the hemorrhoids away. Here's one. This is one. So, I'm at one point. Pete Carroll's gum is at zero. I'm at one. I'm in the lead. I'm in the lead. I'm in the lead. <laughs> I gotta have these. It helps for my fucking hemorrhoids. So these guys are meeting up at a bar. I've seen their videos, you know, meeting up in Jersey, Atlanta, David in the ATL, Sports Live ATL, Sleeto, whatever you want to call him, Mr. Grocery Man. He's happy that he's in, uh, he's in Jersey right now, I guess, I don't know. He's happy he's uh, going to go to the game today, today. Watching his videos. I watched a uh, Desert Eagles video. I watched uh I'm not sure if Nitro Freak made a video. I think he did. I watched David's video. They're you know, he's having a time of his life. So I'm I'm I'm, I'm happy for him. I really am. I'm happy for him. I'm in Coachella, California. Gonna start get going. Heading back to Phoenix. All right, a couple other things I caught my eye in the news. Brett Kavanaugh. I'm a big supporter of Brett Kavanaugh. I love the guy. Supreme Court. Uh, I guess the senators got a vote on him. The constitutionalists we need in the Supreme Court. However, I was watching videos yesterday. I gotta get rid of that trash bag. Shit. So, uh, he was uh, leaving the building, and a guest, Diane Feinstein, Invited this guy in, who's the father of a Parkland victim or whatever. So he walks up to the guy, just kind of surprises him, offers to shake his hand. Brett Kavanaugh just looked at him like, and and, and turned away. I thought that was kind of a prick move on Brett Kavanaugh. I mean, the security jumped in. I understand that, but you got to kind of understand where he's coming from. This unexpected man jumps in and just, you know. If it was me, I would have shook that guy's hand. He lost his daughter in Parkland. I would have shook his hand. But you see what's happening here? 
I think Dianne Feinstein set it up. These fucking Democrat liberals, they're, they're sneaky. They are sneaky. Keep in mind, Dianne Feinstein, she's an anti-gunner. She wants to take all the guns. Keep that in mind. These politicians like that, they want to take all the guns. They will leech on gun violence victims to take the guns. That's how sick they are. They're sick people. They see these gun violence victims, and they're right on them. Dianne Feinstein let the guy in. Now, I'm not blaming the guy. He lost his daughter. But if I was Brett, I would have shook that guy's hand. I would have took the time, told my security to lay off for a second. Now, I would have shook that guy's hand. If it was me. He didn't have the decency to do that. So, Brett, shame on you, Brett. I'm still, I, I'd still vote for you because you're a constitutionalist. But shame on you, Brett. Come on, man. We're better than that. We're better than that. I'm a better person than that. Damn, I love this stuff. Off to the next story. This is a real fucking tragedy. India has legalized gay sex. Not gay marriage. I don't know if gay marriage is legal there or not. I don't know. But gay sex. Oh, fucking faggots are happy. They are fucking happy. I'm watching these queers on fucking TV. Oh my god. Keep in mind, India has a big... Uh, has a big... Um, rapist sexual predator problem. Yeah. The crime there is bad. India... Those Indians are fucking perverts. They are. Those Indian men... Now, I'm not talking Native Americans. I'm talking Indians. There's a difference between Indians and Native Americans. Trust me. If I was talking about Native Americans, I'd spell it out. I'm talking about Indians. Those guys from India. The country India. Those guys are fucking perverts. I don't really go into Facebook dating groups anymore. I mean, I used to back in the day. Um, but those Indian guys, I've seen some of the comments, man. They're just fucking, they're like always fucking horny. They, they're always bragging about the 10-inch cocks. They are the impeccable of the word faggot. The gay ones, anyway. Oh, fucking queers. Anyway. I got my ticket for Sunday. Sunday. Three days. I'm going to that game. Kickoff is at 1.25 p.m. Talking about Indians. We're going to kick some Indian ass. The Redskins. On Sunday. My Arizona Cardinals. And I got the, uh, I got my ticket. It's an e-ticket. Electronic. I gotta go get the actual ticket. Anyway, that's it. I gotta go.